Now, as you can see, what I've done is I've got the water bottles filled to the right level so that when they freeze, they'll freeze just enough to expand and fill the bottles up without cracking them. We don't want to lose the water over the years. We want it to stay in there the whole time. I've used the expansion foam in this particular area because there's soil on the other side, gardens that are going to be on the other side, and I want to make sure that the erosion does not take place. I've allowed this expansion foam to dry and hold these bottles in place so that I can add the other bottles closer because I've used a lot more expansion foam here than I had intended to. And now that this is all dried, I'm going to start putting these bottles in pretty much just like this stacking them up side by side. Once I've got them stacked, I'll do the other layer of expansion foam. And as you can see, these bottles over here, those will be simple drinking water bottles that will stack up in a row, just like that. And they'll fill up, up and up and up and up. And then the expansion foam will just be squeezed in between each spots and up against it to seal it completely off. As the winter comes and freezes the water in the bottles, it'll turn the underside of this house using the same type of effects that Eskimos have used for thousands of years to use frozen blocks of water to actually keep the cold out, turning the whole underside of this house into an igloo insulator. And recycling to the utmost degree.